Hey guys, I'm here with Brian Kroll of Silo Ridge Golf Club. We are in the golf.com full swing simulator. Today I want to talk about irons. I love that feeling when you just flush an iron shot, you yes. know, like two or three times a summer. I do too. I really enjoy that. And I wanted to see maybe if we could talk a little bit about how you can achieve better contact or at least more consistent contact. That's, that's one of the most popular requests from people who want lower scores and want to hit the ball cleanly more often. So there is no substitute for pure centered contact. The question right. is, how do you really know if you're achieving it and how to adjust if you're not? A lot of amateurs and, and people who are out working on their game hit it on the toe, hit it on the heel, but they aren't really sure. It just feels like it wasn't pure. I have the answer for you, Jeff. This works okay. in the- I was hoping you would. This works in the winter. This works in the <laughs> summer on the range. So I have just a little uh, athlete's foot spray and I'm not gonna <laughs> you know, wonder whether you need it for something other than golf, but here we go. So you're gonna take your, your club and you're gonna spray it on there like that, okay? So now that you've had the uh, athlete's foot is that, spray. Is that USGA legal? Uh, <laughs> yep, does uh, nothing. It's totally fine. Okay. So take a couple practice swings here. Okay. Excellent. Always feels good in the practice swing. <laughs> All right, step right up there okay. and take a swing at it. All right, let's take a look. That, my friend, hey, that is, is not that is bad. Not Look, bad. I want the camera to get on that for a long time. That is a beautiful shot. I want that framed. But the, the bottom line is, if you hit it like this every time, you wouldn't be uh, out practicing. You'd be <laughs> shooting low scores. But this foot spray will give anyone out there watching an opportunity to know where they're hitting the face of the club with the ball. And the, and the point is, if you see consistent contact out by the toe, you can adjust, you might be too far from the ball. If it's too close in here, you might need to stand up a little bit, work on your posture. Mm -hmm. Your PGA Pro can help you with it, but it's always nice to have some way of knowing where is that ball hitting my club face. Athlete's foot spray, my friend. I like it.